Here we have the HTC One M8. It's our new latest flagship from HTC. What we've done is improved on the metal finish on the back of the device. So we've actually encapsulated it all the way around to the screen itself. So really kind of bring the metal all the way up to the crisp uh, screen. So really something sim uh, similar to luxury watches, etc., like that. And we've created a great new finish in the back of the device in this metal gray edition has a hairline technique in the back cover that actually caused by striations in the metal when the polishing machine goes over the back of the device itself really creates something that's just so pure and simple beautiful in its uh, execution not only is it a great looking phone it's a great performing phone so first off you don't need to press the power button to get in the phone we have motion launch controls for example a simple double tap of the screen will turn on to the lock screen itself or a simple swipe left on the screen will uh, will create go straight to the bink feed itself so something very easy to get to where you want to on the phone itself the phone is uh, is running HTC uh, Sense 6 and KitKat, latest version of Android. And it has, with our latest Sense version, a new version of our Blink Field that's more flowing, natural in its performance, but also offers you a great way of adding new content from all the content providers that we have in uh, our, uh, our Blink Feed sources. So a really simple and intuitive way of doing it. But, We've, uh, we've added some amazing things that you can do with the phone itself. So first off, when you go into the camera, if you uh, take a picture with the camera, it has a duo camera on the back of the device that at the same time is capturing an amazing picture with our ultra pixel camera. Uh, it also captures the depth information of that picture. So wh what I mean by the depth information, so if I just take a picture from the gallery, and just go into the picture itself. After I've taken the picture, I can edit it. It's turned off the rotation, sorry. Uh, and I can refocus on different parts of the picture depending on where I want to uh, refocus on the actual screen of the device and that's all done by or a single one shot take so I'm not taking multiple shots and having to refocus to those multiple shots every picture I take I'm taking the spatial information of every pixel in that picture itself so really creating something great I can also do some amazing things uh, with that picture itself so for example I can create a foregrounder effect which allows us to, to cut out the subject, the focus point of the picture, and add some really cool effects to the actual picture itself. Or I can add some seasonal uh, animation to that picture itself and really changing the skin tones depending on the season. Or a very cool one is using Dimension Plus, which allows me to tilt the picture at different angles so that I can create a different vantage point on the picture itself. So a 3D-like esque to the picture, but not a 3D picture in itself. So that's a, a great experience when uh, when using the uh, the phone itself. But uh, we're also creating a Zoe application, and that Zoe application allows you to share your highlight. Uh, uh, videos with friends and family so that you can create other highlight videos together something that allows you to make the, the the automatically created videos much more social and interactive for you and and it won't be restricted to even HTC phones we will allow other Android devices to take advantage of, of adding the information from highlight videos but when you're listening to highlight videos from the front speakers we wanted to create a great sound experience so the phone itself has HCC boom sound as before but we've uh, increased the speaker chamber size uh, and redesigned them and redesigned the speaker layout so it actually is 25 percent more louder but we've also improved the actual clarity of the pictures of the sound itself so what we've done is uh, created a multi-phase amplifier to the phone itself that allows us to independently amplify different parts of the track itself. And what that means is if you take a, a, a track with heavy bass and soft vocals, we can actually independently adjust the unamplified different parts of the track so that they get the optimum amount of the, uh, on this music itself. So really you hear absolutely crisp bass but an incredibly great low and um, uh, the mid and the high frequencies from the uh, track itself to really create just a 
absolutely immersive sound, a much more rounder sound. So you really hear every note uh, and every side note that that track is intended to show. We've, uh, we've also, uh, as you can see on the screen side, we've increased the scene, screen size. It's a 4.5 uh, inch display. Uh, and that allows us to uh, have an absolute crisp, clear uh, definition on the screen. So the contrast ratios, the angles of which you can see this screen are just phenomenal. Really beautiful in its, in its view of the actual uh, the screen itself. It is everything you'd expect from a flagship. So it is running LTE, it is running NFC, it has an IR port as well, and it has a bigger battery. So inside the phone itself is a 2,600 milliampere battery that will aim to be 40% more efficient than last year's flagship phone. So it really is going to be in a great power efficiency uh, uh, device really lasting you, uh, kind of, even if you're a heavy unit to the second business day. The, the overall uh, device actually includes a nano SIM slot and a storage slot. So you can have an up to 128 gig uh, SD card, micro SD card in the side of the device. So really expanding the amount of storage available on the phone itself. So the 16 gig on board, the 128 gig micro SD slot, and the 60 up to 65 gig Google Drive that you get when you have this phone really creates 209 gigabytes of possible uh, storage on this phone. It is a quad core, 2.3 gigahertz phone with two gig of RAM um, and uh, a Snapdragon 801 processor. So it really does speed through all the uh, things that you want to do when using a phone. And the cameras, as I said, is our duo camera with our depth information, ultra pixels, so capturing uh, pictures at any light, and also an amazing front-facing camera, five megapixel wide angle, uh, uh, f2.0 lens so really is the best possible uh, picture for the front itself but all in all it's not just about the features it's about the beauty of the device this is something you carry with you all your time and it has to look good and this does look amazing so this is the new HTC One M8 and it's due out it's, we're announcing it on the 25th and it will be due out shortly after that but specific regional verification will be announced on the 25th as well thank you very much